Craig G. I'm from Queensbridge. I've done some things and some stuff. I rap a little bit. A little bit. <laughs> some things and some stuff. Just a little bit. No. I rap bit. a little, just a little taste. I rap a taste. But, um, you know, man, I've just been around for a long time, man. 30-something years, man. My first record came out in 1985. I was 12 years old. It was the rap version of Shout. Wow. Down with the Almighty Juice Crew Collective, you know, Biz, rest in peace, Kane, G Rap, Shan, Molly, Shantae, right. Master Ace, mm-hmm. you know. Um, man, these kids got computers. Google me. That's, <laughs> that's what we trying to get them to you do. Don't know. You know, we know. Look them up. And shout out to Premier, because I was speaking to him a little earlier, and he was talking about, like, yo, when he first met you, he's like, yo, that, was, that dude was one of my favorite MCs. So I was all giddy to meet him. So it was kind of dope. We just talked about that just now. Well, the crazy thing is, mm-hmm. Premier brags about me being like one of the first rappers from New York he ever spoke to. Right. Because when Guru got down with the original gang song, Wild Pitch, before Premier, right. I used to hang out with Guru. Right. Like they came, they came to BLS. I used to answer the phones on the Rap Attack and on Marley Show. Right. And they came to the station, and you know I was cool with Guru. So me, him, and Stu Fine wound up going to some club or something, and I actually like hung out with Guru. And then, you know, we used to call each other, and I would hang out with him when he moved to the Bronx. I was hanging out with him, so you know yeah. we got a lot of history. Oh yeah. Oh so, yeah. Like you were one of the first yeah. I, I met. <laughs> 